Hey everybody, welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel. Today, we got round two of the trick shot tournament. Before we start the tournament, I just wanna say all these trick shots are really good, even if you lose. So everybody did really good. Also, a lot of people have been setting in old trick shots from like a couple months ago. So for the next two rounds, I don't want old trick shots, I want new ones from the last month. So yeah, and there is four different matchups. We have Trickshot Bros versus Brayden, Crazy Impossible versus So Incredible, Epic Ezra versus Trick Legacy, and No Family Vlogs versus Legendary Trick Shots. All right, let's get into the first matchup. We have Trickshot Bros versus Brayden. I'll play Trickshot Bros, Trickshot first. Here it is. Ding. Double flip. I did it. 2.0. Now for Braden's. For this trick shot, I'm going to bounce a ping pong ball off of this board. Off of this board is going to land into the mini cup, which has a nickel on it, which will release the nickel, roll down the ramp, and go into the mini cup, which will then roll and go into the other cup. Really good shot. Get a dart in his hand, double flip into the basketball standing. Really good shot. So we got a four to five on entertainment, a four to five on camera slash editing, a five out of five on creativity, and a nine out of ten on difficulty. Really good job by Trick Shot Bros. And you got a 22 out of 25 for his final score. All right, now to Braden scoring. I really like the shot. It was like a chain reaction shot with cups and nickels and ping pong balls. Really good shot. So on entertainment, he got a four out of five. On camera slash editing, he got a four out of five. On creativity, he got a five out of five. And for difficulty, a nine out of 10. So, Trickshot Bros with a 22 out of 25. And Braden with 22 out of 25. So it is a, that means it's a tie. So what we would do in this situation is, well, in the last round, I picked who I think has the better YouTube channel overall. But I'm changing that up. So what's going to happen is, you guys, anybody that's watching this video can vote. Who they think has a better trick shot, like Trick Shot Bros or Brayden, you can pick either one. So yeah, you guys that are voting for the uh, Trick Shot Bros or Brayden, you guys only have one day to vote. So it's the most votes in one day. So yeah, make sure to vote very soon. All right, now into the next matchup. We have Crazy Impossible versus So Incredible. I'll play Crazy Impossible's Trick Shot first. Here it is. Now for So Incredible. All right, now let's get on to the scoring. I really like Crazy Impossible's trick shot. He flipped a marker onto this like little block. Really good. So he got a four to five in entertainment a four to five on camera slash editing, a four to five on creativity, and eight out of 10 on difficulty. Really good shot by Crazy Impossible. This brings the shot to 20 out of 25. All right, now for some incredible scoring. I really like the shot. He flipped a water bottle, put a Jenga block on top, and flipped another water bottle on top of it. Really good shot. So you get a four to five on entertainment, a three to five on camera slash editing. It was all right on um, uh, quality. It wasn't amazing. So that's why I'm giving it a three to five. It's still really good. All right, so that brings our totals to Crazy Impossible for 20 out of 25. And So Incredible with 21 out of 25, which means So Incredible is moving on to the next round. So So Incredible, just send the trick shot to my Google Drive account up there or give me your next shot in the description of this video. 
So let's get on to the next matchup. All right, so the next matchup is gonna be Epic Ezra versus Trick Legacy. I'll play Epic Ezra's Trick Shot first. Here it is. Now for Trick Legacies. All right, now into the scoring. Epic Ezra, I really like your shot. It was on the trampoline, jumping and threw the ball into the hoop. Really good shot, you're pretty far away too. But I'm not sure if a lot of you guys realized, but he actually did a front flip before, so that made his score go up a lot. So he got a four to five on entertainment, a four to five on camera slash editing, a 5 out of 5 in creativity, and a 7 out of 10 on difficulty. Really good performance by Epic Ezra, which brings his total to a 20 out of 25. All right, now for Trick Legacy score. I really like the shot. 20 stack onto a water ball. Really good shot. I think we all like that. Really good. So for entertainment, you get a 4 to 5. For camera slash editing, a 4 to 5 as well. For creativity, a 3 out of 5. We have seen a lot of people do 20 stacks on two water balls, but still pretty creative. And for difficulty, a 9 out of 10. Really good shot. So, that brings our totals to Epic Ezra with a 20 out of 25. And Trick Legacy with 20 out of 25, which means it's a draw again. So remember, anybody that's watching this video has one day the vote. Who they think has a better trick shot? Epic has a trick legacy. So yeah, you guys can vote. Just comment down below if you think has a better trick shot. Epic has a trick legacy. You can vote for either one, obviously. All right, now into the final matchup. We have No Family Vlogs versus Legendary Trick Shots. I'll play No Family Vlogs clip first. Here it is. <gasps> Let's go. You did it. Wow. You did it. Wow. Now for legendary trick shots. Shot. Boo, boo, boo. All right, now into the scoring. No family vlogs, I really like the shot. Had a ping pong racket in his hand, had a ping pong ball in the other hand. Blew out two candles at once with one ping pong ball. Really good shot. So you get a four to five in entertainment, a four to five on camera slash editing, and a 4 out of 5 in creativity. And a 9 out of 10 on difficulty. Really good shot. So that brings us total to a 21 out of 25. Good job, no family vlogs. All right, now into legendary trick shot score. I really like the shot. Flipped a water bottle, put a glue stick on top, and then capped another water bottle on top of that. Really good shot. So we've got a 4 to 5 in entertainment, a 4 to 5 in camera slash editing, a 4 to 5 in creativity, and... A 9 out of 10 on difficulty. So, no family vlogs of a 21 out of 25. Really good shot. And legendary trick shots with 21 out of 25, which means it's another draw. So remember, anybody that's watching this video can vote for either one, no family vlogs or legendary trick shots. You guys have one day to vote. So then at the end, we'll tally up who has the most votes and then... Whoever has the most will send me their next trick shot. All right, I hope you guys liked the video and you guys have a week and a half to send me your next trick shot until March 30th. And the, the semifinals of the trick shot tournament will be coming out on March 30th. So, hope you liked the video. Make sure to like and subscribe. See you!